Hello, my name is Ozra and welcome back to Game of Thrones Season 7, Episode 7. This is the Wolf and the Dragon. Looks like they're gonna give us a back um, recap slash backstory uh, of all the other episodes. I will be splitting this in two parts as usual. And also I will be uh, uploading this uh, with edits obviously uh, due to copyright and all that. And uh, if you want to see the unedited version though, you can always visit my Vidme and uh, look if I uh, if I've uploaded there, but the thing about it is I I, I may or may not uh, depending on how I feel like it. Uh, but also I most likely will because I'm just like yeah I, I think I just want to show middle fingers to the copyright. The copyright sketch is coming up real soon. Uh, Dicky is editing it. Whatever it's his thing. So um, yeah. Anyway, uh, let's jump right into this one and uh, let's go. Are you a boy? Where are they? Come and get her. Are you a boy? So let's jump right in. So let's jump right into this one. Yeah, a lot of people, uh, you know, uh, criticize about that, but, you know, I just like, yeah, this is, you know, what he needs to do to survive, so I definitely think he kind of chose the right choice, because, like, you know, survival is very important in the Game of Thrones, you know, that... Uh, but I, I, I definitely think he will save uh, her later on. Uh, that was the uh, Walter Frey's face. I did think it was Donald Trump's face as well. I'm no, I'm not perfect. <laughs> it's your face. <laughs> yeah, it's Tyrion. You can ask yourself. She has more important requests. The Night King. Yep, that's right. What if we prove her wrong? Bring the dead to her. Yep. Uh, the Javelin uh, Javelin Master 2017 Westeros Games is the Night King. <laughs> yeah, I saw I saw the memes and I was like, yep. Thank you, my queen. Yeah, he said my queen. Ten out of ten. And he woke up. Uh, Viserion. A lot of people were tell. Uh, well, not a lot of people, my friends told me, yeah, it's Viserion. Uh, I will skip the intro, I'm so sorry about that. Sorry. Uh, just that, uh, uh, copyright is really, really stringent on that, so I'm sorry about that, but... Hey, I do what I gotta do. <laughs> Grey Worm looking good though and I kinda miss uh, seeing Grey Worm so uh, yeah so they're just like waiting for uh, Daenerys type of thing <laughs> oh they're still at Casterly Lo uh, Rock Casterly Lock Casterly Rock sorry okay no, 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 it went somewhere else, I think. How come the, uh, there's Lannister guards? Don't they see, uh, Dothraki outside, though? Pinch, my lord. How many barrels? 500, my lord. Get 500 more. Yes, my lord. Why are they waiting? <laughs> I still enjoy it when they call me my lord. The thrill will say. If I live that long. <laughs> if I live that long. Men without cocks. Men without cocks. Co <laughs> True. What's left to fight for? Gold. Mm. I spent my life around soldiers. What do you think they spend that gold on? Oh. True. Family. Not without a cock, you don't. <laughs> Not without a cock, you don't. <laughs> cocks in the air. 
Yet your brother has chosen to side with the cockles. Yes. Always been a champion of the downtrodden. Oh, there's more. I knew it. I was like, well, this uh, looks a tad bit timid as well. So one is really disciplined and the other is just like savages, savages, you know. <laughs> I think we're about to be the downtrodden. You think? <laughs> oh man, I, I love that guy. I keep forgetting his name. Braun? Is it Braun? Not sure. There's so many names. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Greyjoy. Theon <laughs> Greyjoy. See, I almost forgot, but here I am. <laughs> How many people live here? A million, give or take. It's more people than the entire north crammed into that. Why would anyone want to live that way? There's more work in the city. Brothels are far superior. Is, are, are they gonna find that um, that woman and her uh, kid died? Why? Just why, bro? Seriously, look at that. Like, it's it's gonna come loose. Why isn't she with them? I'm afraid I don't know your race and I want to see her. And the rest of them? They're on their way to the Dragon Pit now. Including our brother? Yes, your grace. Mm. If anything goes wrong, kill the silver-haired bitch first. <laughs> kill the silver-haired bitch. the bastard who calls himself king. The rest of them you can kill in any order you see fit. Come, Sir Gregor. It's time for us to meet our guests. Why did they build it? Dragons don't understand the difference between what is theirs and what isn't. Land, livestock, children. Letting them roam free around the city was a problem. I imagine it was a sad joke at the end. An entire arena, two sickly creatures smaller than dogs. In the beginning, it was home, Larry and the Dread. It must have been the most dangerous place in the world. Maybe it still is. <laughs> Maybe it still is. <laughs> uh. Welcome, my lord. Yeah, Your friends not arrived before you did. I've been sent to escort you all to the meeting. Mm -hmm. Pleasant surprise and unpleasant situation. I never thought I'd see you again, my lord. Supporting the enemy, no less. Hard to blame you? Cersei will, anyway. Glad you're alive. Come on. You can suck his magic cock later. <laughs> you can suck his magic cock later. <laughs> What's in there? Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off. Thought you were dead. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. You came pretty close. 
I was only trying to protect her. You and me both. You and me both. She's alive. Aryan. Where? Winterfell. Yeah, she belongs. Protecting her if you're here. Sansa. The only one that needs protecting is the one that gets in her way. <laughs> Here we are. The heroes of Blackwood Fair. Strange place for a reunion. It is, my lord. I don't think I'm anyone's lord anymore, Roger. Save the titles for some broad of the Blackwood. Oh. Sure your new queen will be happy to restore yours? If she ends up on the throne? I've been thinking about your new queen. Perhaps you've been reconsidering your allegiances. Remember my offer. Whatever they're paying you, I'll pay double. And that would be double what now, exactly? Don't you worry about me. I'm doing all right. Looking after myself. Are you? Helping me to arrange this meeting wasn't exactly looking after yourself, was it? <laughs> you put yourself at risk. I put yourself at risk. Important difference. <laughs> put yourself at risk. Your head, Queen Cersei's offered a bag of gold for us, not mine. <laughs> now, thanks to me, she's got two traitors' heads coming right through her door. She can lock them both off. As soon as she gets tired of the clever words and pour out their piles. All thanks to Sabrona the fucking Blackwood. <laughs> That's not looking after myself, I don't know what is. True. It's good to see you again. Yeah, you too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they have a level of respect for each other. <laughs> Anyone touches it? I'll kill you first. <laughs> Anyone touches it, I'll kill you first. Oh, nice. Nice and open, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> ah, nice. It is really nice. I, I love the setting. A friend of mine said uh, some part, uh, some uh, parts of this uh, this uh, this series was filmed in Spain, so I would really like to see that one day. I have enough money. <laughs> Maybe a castle of my own. Something's off. I left this shit city because I didn't want to die in it. <laughs> and I'll die in this shit city. Maybe. Well, this is all your idea. Seems every bad idea has some bounce to cut behind it. And some clicking kind to help them see it through. And some cooking cut to see it through. <laughs> I love the banter, man. <laughs> it's just so awesome. Jamie shared a look there. Oh, the uncle and uh, Theon. Mm -hmm. I love that they have all new like armor and shit. So.
doesn't matter. It's not how it ends for you, brother. Oh. You know who's coming for you. You've always known. I did not know that. Or I may have forgotten Where that. Where is she? She'll be here soon. Didn't travel with you. No. Awkward <laughs> tensions rising high here. <laughs> Awkward. Oh, there she is. What an entrance. Hello, hello, hello. Unimpressed. Mad Cersei is fucking on point, man. She knows that if she even flinches for one moment, she'll give off that she is terrified of this big man. Oh. She flinched. Well, I was wrong. <laughs> Nice to see you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Have any pertinence? To begin with larger concerns. And why are you talking? You're the smallest concern here. Do you remember when we discussed the fourth jokes? These wasn't even good. We explained it at the end. Never explained it. Always ruins it. You don't even let your kind live in the Iron Islands, you know. We'll kill you at birth. Neck the mercy for the parents. Perhaps you ought to sit down. Why? Sit down or leave. <laughs> Sit down or leave. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tensions are rising higher and higher. <laughs> Rest in peace. That dude. That uncle. Anyway. We are a group of people who do not like one another. As this recent demonstration has shown. <laughs> We have suffered at each other's hands. We have lost people we love at each other's hands. If all we wanted was more of the same, there would be no need for this gathering. We are entirely capable of waging war against each other without meeting face to face. So instead we should settle our differences and live together in harmony for the rest of our days. We all know that will never happen. And why are we here? This isn't about living in harmony. It's just about living. The same thing is coming for all of us. A general you can't negotiate with. An army that doesn't leave corpses behind on the battlefield. Well, Tyrion tells me a million people live in this city. They're about to become a million more soldiers in the army of the dead. I imagine for most of them it would be an improvement. This is serious. I wouldn't be here if it weren't. I don't think it's serious at all. I think it's another bad joke. Mm. The 
if my brother Jamie is informed me correctly, you're asking me for a truce. Yes. That's all. That's all. Pull back my armies and stand down while you go on your monster hunt. Or while you solidify and expand your position. Hard for me to know which it is, with my armies pulled back. Until you return and march on my capital with four times the men. Your capital will be safe until the Northern Thresh is dealt with. You have my word. The word of a would-be usurper. There is no conversation that will erase the last 50 years. We have something to show you. I think it's not. I think it's not even gonna move, man. I don't know, but uh, yeah, it's uh, it's uh, nice to kind of figure out what they're gonna do, and I'm I'm really scared for for the others. So I I think it's an escape or not. Just Moment of truth. Come on, baby. Come on. She did not expect this. Yeah. I, I I think I think it's safe to put it back, man. Come on. Yep. Destroy them by burning them. And we can destroy them with dragon gloves. If we don't win this fight, then that is the fate of every person in the world. Yep. It's gone. Magic. <laughs> I've been waiting to use that line. <laughs> there is only one war that matters. The Great War. And it is here. Winter has come, baby. I didn't believe it until I saw. I saw them all. Thousand at least. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this way. No. Good. I'm taking the Iron Fleet back to the Iron Islands. What are you talking about? everything things you couldn't imagine in this this is one of them this is the only thing I've ever seen that terrifies me oh <laughs> noise I'm going back to my island you should go back to yours when winter's over we'll be the only ones left alive 
Well, she ain't gonna run like you, bruh. <laughs> oh, there you have He's it. He's right to be afraid. And a coward to run. <laughs> if those things come for us, there'll be no kingdoms to rule. Everything we suffered would have been for nothing. Everything we lost would have been for nothing. That's right. I'll accept your truth. Until the dead are defeated. They are the true enemy. In return, the king in the north will extend this truce. He will remain in the north where he belongs. He will not take up arms against the Lannisters. He will not choose sides. Just the king in the north? Not me. <laughs> I would never ask it of you. No! <laughs> You would never agree to it. Yeah, that's true. I would trust you even less than I do now. <laughs> I ask it only of Ned Stark's son. I know Ned Stark's son will be true to his word. Rest in peace. Yeah. <laughs> Rip Jon Snow. I am true to my word. Or I try to be. That is why I cannot give you what you ask. I cannot serve two queens. And I've already pledged myself to Queen Daenerys of House Targaryen. Then there is nothing left to discuss. Oh. The dead will come north first. Enjoy dealing with them. We will deal with whatever is left of you. Was that the right choice, though? So, Jamie. It's been good to see you. I imagine the next time we'll be across the battlefield. We both saw what just happened. We both saw that thing. Yes, and I'm not looking forward to seeing more of them. So I'm loyal to the Queen, and you're loyal to sons and adult brothers. Oh, fuck loyalty! Fuck loyalty? This goes beyond houses and honor and oaths. Talk to the Queen. And tell her what? <laughs> I didn't even wait for an answer. Grateful for your loyalty. But my dragon died so that we could be here. If it's all for nothing, then he died for nothing. For nothing, yeah. I know. I'm pleased you bent the knee to our queen. I would have advised it, had you asked. But have you ever considered learning how to lie every now and then? Just a bit. Just a turn. I'm not gonna swear an oath I can't uphold. Talk about my father if you want. Tell me that's the attitude that got him killed. But when enough people make false promises, words stop meaning anything. Then there are no more answers, only better and better lies. And lies won't help us in this fight. That is indeed a problem. The more immediate problem is that we're fucked. <laughs> yeah, you're here for your video. This is how we might change that state of affairs. Only one. Everyone stays here. I go and talk to my sister. I didn't come all this way to have my hand murdered. I don't want Cersei to murder me either. I could have stayed in my cell and saved a great deal of trouble. I did this. I should go. She'll definitely murder you. <laughs> She'll definitely I murder you. See my sister alone. Will we all go home. And we're right back where we started.
so what are you gonna say bro like i just mean like you know 